Hi everybody, hope you're well. So I'm back in my stable and I'm gonna upgrade the stables today because I've got enough star coins to do so. And I think I have 18 horses and I can upgrade the 18 stalls so it'd be nice to have everybody in the stable at the same time because that's never happened before. So we're gonna go outside and speak to John who will allow us to upgrade. And I've not upgraded any of this before so we're gonna be doing the full three upgrades today. I'm gonna get the whole haul. So I think John's over here. Yeah, there he is, okay. Hi Dragoslava, lovely day today, isn't it? Aha, just lovely. If I'm being honest, I'm feeling a bit fidgety. There's a lot to do here, but maybe that's why you're here, Dragoslava. Are you here to upgrade your stable? Yes, I am. So do you want to rebuild your stable and upgrade to level one? Your stable will have two additional horse boxes for a total of 14 boxes, okay. Are you sure you want to upgrade? Yes, we're going to do level 1 upgrade. Your stable is being upgraded. Okay. I hope I can just do all three, one after another. I'm guessing. I don't know, we'll see in a minute, I guess. I don't know if it's going to take me like straight back into my stables or I'm going to still be outside. I suppose it's it silly for it to take me in. It's taking quite a while. There we go. Okay. Stable upgrade is finished. Right. He's going through the same thing again. So this is for another two. Okay. So all of the upgrades each are 249 and there's three of them. So that's close to like 750, I think, approximately. Um, I think it's just short of 750 star coins altogether, which I don't think is too bad. I think the price is reasonable. Okay, so one more time. So this is the final upgrade. Um, so that we have all of the boxes and then I'm going to bring everybody back because it's been a long time since everybody's been back in the stable. Not everybody has like been there for ages, like I do generally bring different ones back and forth. Not There's been very few that actually stay there for long periods of time, but I like having everybody in the stable. I like the idea of that. Um, so let's go see. So we finished the entire upgrade. So let's go have a look then. You enter your stable. The one thing that I do have to say I'm sad about is I can't actually eat pizza in there or any other food at that table. But anyway, alright, let's have a look now that this has been upgraded. Oh, it definitely has. It's, there's a lot more stalls down the bottom. I was wondering where the stalls were going to be put, so this is where they are. That's quite neat. So we've got two down here. Let me think. That was one. Right, that's, that's two of the upgrades there. So where was the other one? Um, was it down here? Yes, it was. Mint is not in the wall this time. Right, we'll bring back some here. Uh, we'll bring back Bob. There we go, there's Bob. Good boy, Bob. Right, now, where is the name plate? Oh, there it is, okay. Right. I'm gonna bring back Baby into here. She can be by Danger Cake for now. And then I think we'll put the ponies down the bottom. Actually, I think I do have. Actually, yeah. Dougal's in there. Edge is still on Pony. Well, he's not on Pony Island anymore. He's in the pastures. Right, now. I'm gonna put Bjorn. Or no, sorry, Kuro there and Bjorn next door. That was it. Okay. There is Bjorn there. Right, now. I'm going to put everybody else out here. There's Prince. Um, beside Prince, I'm going to put Edge. So that is everybody back. There are no horses in your pasture at the moment. If your stable is full and you buy more horses, you will automatically end up in the pasture. You can move your horses freely between the box stalls and the pasture. That's kind of good because that means you don't have to like run back. Okay, I'm back. I got a network error and it decided to die on me. So, um, In general, I like the upgrade. I'm happy with that. That means I've got all my horses back here at the minute. I probably will end up sending a bunch of them away to the pasture. Um, because there's far too many in here to look after. But I do love the new stables. I think they're fantastic. I know a lot of people have been like um, annoyed that, you know, it doesn't matter where you put your horses because if you start riding a different horse then it switches them here because Dark King, which is Blur, 
he's the one that I'm riding at the minute, so he's automatically assigned to that stable, and if I switch to a different horse, then it'll assign them, and it'll put him to a different stable. So it kind of means you can't put your horses where you want to put them. And I know that can be quite annoying, like, I think if I was to spend the time arranging them, that would probably bother me, but I've decided not to, because I know otherwise it will. So I've just kind of let them go into the assigned boxes that they've gone into, so I don't mind too much if they move around. But I think it could be more of a problem if I had more horses than this. I mean, 18's a lot, but I remember everybody, you know, out of that 18. I think if I have, like, 50, I'd never remember who anybody was. So, now that is the stable upgrade, so it's, it's all done now. That's, I can't do any more upgrades, and that is all of my horses back in the stalls. Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it there. I hope you've had a lovely day, and bye-bye!